Welcome to my video on the new and improved method for upgrading your iPhone to an unlocked and jailbroken 2.1 firmware. This video will cover the unlocking and jailbreaking of the original iPhone and the jailbreaking of the 3G. Uh, please note if your 3G is not already unlocked, this will not unlock it. This will only jailbreak the 3G. And before we begin, you're going to need to obtain some files. You can find the links in the more info section of this video. And after you obtain all these, uh, you need to install iTunes and the new and improved QuickPone uh, before proceeding. <clears throat> And after that's done, uh, be sure to update your iPhone to 2.1 uh, via iTunes before going ahead. And to do this, you simply open iTunes, and uh, it should prompt you to update your iPhone to 2.1 uh, with the iPhone plugged in uh, via your USB cable or dock. Okay, let's begin. Go ahead and open QuickPone. And at this point, your iPhone should be plugged in via USB and turned on. And if you're connected and turned on, go ahead and click Next. And on this screen, it should find your 2.1 file automatically. You can wait for the green check mark, or you can browse to the file if you wish. And once you see the green check mark, go ahead and click Next. Add Cydia, add Installer, and Unlock Phone, and click Next. And then we are going to point to the bootloader files on the desktop that uh, you downloaded. Uh, BL39 is bootloader 3.9, and BL46 is bootloader 4.6, of course. And once you have these uh, selected and pointed to in the correct location, go ahead and click Next. And if you're connected and turned on, once again, click Next. And now we're going to wait for the program to put your phone in recovery mode. You should see the spinning activity wheel uh, on your iPhone, and then it will go to the USB recovery logo uh, on the iPhone screen. And once in recovery mode, uh, we're going to put the phone in the special communications mode, so all you have to do is simply follow the on-screen uh, on instructions as it goes along. And just follow along each particular step, and you'll notice on the last step where the countdown begins at 30, it will only reach about 20 or so before the files actually start transferring. And once these files start transferring, you can go ahead and let go of the home button and there is no need to hold it for the entire 30 seconds. And now the files are transferring. You can go, let, go ahead and let go of the home button if you haven't done so and uh, let this process complete. When it's finished you can close QuickPone. Your iPhone will reboot into a special bootloader screen the first time. Just let it do its thing. Uh, this requires no input from you and once it reboots into the springboard you are uh, at an unlocked and jailbroken 2.1 uh, as you can see this is a much easier process than in the past and you can uh, start this process from uh, any version firmware you wish locked or unlocked doesn't matter uh, I did this particular phone starting at 1.1 uh, 1.4 actually and uh, I've also done it from 2.0.2 uh, .2, and uh, all has worked equally well and uh, that's all there is to it and thanks for watching and good luck